Hello everyone, I am Dr. Sanita Sarkin, Pediatric Ophthalmologist working at Chaitanya Eye Institute, Kochi. Today I am to talk about a very important topic, congenital glaucomas. Congenital glaucomas are glaucomas which occur in very young children or even newborns. The causes of congenital glaucomas or developmental glaucomas are mostly genetic and because of some genetic factors there occurs a obstruction to the normal passage of the fluid within the eye which results in accumulation of fluid and increased pressure inside the eye. This can damage the optic nerve and can impair vision. What are the symptoms of congenital glaucoma? As I already mentioned, typically newborns or very young children are affected the most important symptom is a prominence of the eye that is because of stretching of the outer cords of the eye the size of the eye hole may be larger than normal this is accompanied by loss of normal luster of the front part of the eye which is the cornea due to edema within the corneal tissues again because of this the child may have pain sensitivity to light and difficulty in opening the eyes. Also watering and redness may be present. How can we treat congenital glaucomas? The treatment is mostly surgical and the most important part is prompt diagnosis. With today's technology it is possible to provide good surgery for these children with the best results and also good potential for vision. If delayed, the child can go into permanent visual impairment or even blindness. So, in relation to the glaucoma month observance by the All India Ophthalmological Society, I request all of you to be aware of this uh, per perfectly curable disease, but uh, if not detected at the correct time which has the potential to impair vision and uh, let's spread awareness about the congenital glaucomas so that those children who are born with this disease see the world in a much better way. Thank you.